We continue to follow developing news in Bristol. That's where an investigation is underway into what started as a deadly fire on 4th Street early this morning. Channel 3's Eva Zamaris spoke with a man who lives inside that multifamily home, and he described to her what happened and how they worked to get everyone out. The west side of the house was like a glow, an orange glow. That's when Mike says he knew something was wrong. I opened the curtain, all I seen was smoke. Mike lives on the second floor of this multifamily home on 4th Street in Bristol with his brother. He jumped into action when he realized the house was on fire. This is what Mike says was going through his mind. Get my brother out, get the dog out, and get the people out downstairs. Crews were called here around 2 this morning. When firefighters arrived, there was heavy fire coming from the back of the home. While some of them managed to escape the powerful flames and overwhelming smoke, two people needed to be rescued. Well, the challengers were getting the victims out, so we had to delay the firefighting operation to remove the occupants of the building. The deputy chief of the Bristol Fire Department tells us one person was taken to the hospital for care, and one man died on scene. Mike says they're still processing the news. You could rebuild the house, you could, you could replant a tree, you could cut hedges down, but you can't save, you can't fix people. The American Red Cross has now stepped in to assist those displaced by this fire. Mike says they're grateful for the support they've received so far. I praise the Bristol Police Department. I mm -hmm. praise the fire department. Mm -hmm. They did an excellent job on helping us out. Call Red Cross, the whole nine yards. I could, you couldn't ask for any more. The cause of this fire is now under investigation by local and state fire marshals. In Bristol, Eva Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.